Hey guys, it's me. So, the lighting's really bad in my kitchen. Same as in the front room and in my room. So, I've got a time lapse. I've got to start that in a minute. So I've got all my makeup over here and that case. So, we're going to try and get a good video out of it. Hopefully, you can hear me over my dog playing. But this uh, makeup was challenged by my friend Chloe. She challenged me to do a pink eye, smoke, well, pink smoky eye. I'm very nervous about this, but let's jump into it. So first of all, you're going to want to put down a white layer, uh, white or bright base. Thanks, Mum. So I've been using PS Contour Kit from Primark, it's not good for a contour but it's good for eyeshadow and eyebrows so I've put down, I'm putting down the lightest one so I'm going to have to try I'm going to hopefully do this in parts and obviously I'm going to get interrupted as per usual so I'm also going to post the time lapse of this whole thing as well that's done so I just looked up smoky eye uh, and it's scary I am terrified of this so I'm going to be using a wide range of uh, palettes so the two ones I've mainly chosen are Academy of Colour and um, Pro Makeup Pro London Pro Eyeshadow Collection. I've been using this palette for ages, but only seven shades. <laughs> I've had this um, London eyeshadow palette for about four years, and yeah, I stick to the same colours. You can't really see it on here, but I'll post the time lapse and you'll see it much better. So I'm going. I'm gonna. I'm not sure where to start. So I'm probably going to just start with this pink, oh you can't even see it, this pink, I'll show it to the time, the brightness is much better on the time lapse, so I don't know what brushes I use because I'm not an expert here, so we ain't trying to be James Charles, so what I'm doing, I'm starting at the top of my eye, my uh, cut crease would be so I'm just doing that back and forth I'm probably just going to be moving the camera around if it annoys you I'm sorry I will have better lighting soon when I get into my own, when I get into my own shed so I'm just touching that up this is probably going to look nothing like the tutorial I watched earlier so like I said it's going to be much better on the time lapse I'll post the time lapse as well I look pretty cute on the time lapse so the thing I'm most worried wait where's my tape gone so if I was watching a tutorial earlier if my camera dies I'll have to charge it where they put tape on their eyes all boxed off I look like a right idiot, you can't even see it on the camera. <laughs> I look like an idiot. But I've taken a picture so don't worry. I don't know that idea. So they've done this to catch Fallout, which is like the exish eyeshadow. So this is I have like five minutes left to film in, so I'll have to going to put this on my I got a new Mac as well so I have to go and put it on my Mac so once they've done that they've done a, the darkest one which is still going to be the pro makeup one I broke the part so I'm going for the darker shade now so I'm going to put that underneath where I've just done it so this could either go really good or really horrible. So 
so I know I haven't done my I uh, foundation or con I don't do contour. I've never done contour in my life. Um, I know I haven't done that, but I'm probably going to do that afterwards. See how this looks. So in the tutorial they had black in it, so I'm tempted to try it. If it all goes wrong, I won't post the video. I'll just post the time lapse. <laughs> So I've got a whole collection, so I've just got to go and grab a brush quick. That. So I've just grabbed this tiny brush, but I also grabbed a black, kind of a glittery black eyeshadow from Technique. Um, I know, I'm like an idiot. <laughs> what in the tutorial, I watched that say. And they kind of, so where the eyeshadow, uh, the Cellar tape is you want to kind of go from the corner of your eye upwards in a brush stroke motion. So then from where you do that, you do it from the middle of your eye and you brush towards the stroke you've just done. If I could do an eyeshadow like this one. This is what they've done in the video and it's pretty good. <laughs> But let's be honest, this is not a tutorial, I'm just showing you how to mess up. Okay. <laughs> this off. Now you want to do the same on the other eye. So, just remember, I've never done a flaky eye before in my whole entire existence on this earth. So I was hoping this girl was going to choose something easy for me. Shout out to Kai for challenging me. This is going to look really bad. But it's fine, because I'm going to put makeup fail in this. So now you want to do is you want to kind of just fill in the triangle, but don't go past the corner of your eye. So I feel so just your guys. Oh my god, this looks absolutely hor horrendous. And you're going to peel away. That is a nice ass cut. <laughs> Mum? Yeah? What do you think so far? What do you think so far? They can't even see you. What do you think? What do you think so far? <laughs> I don't want to go on there. Well, if you're going to a theatre, yeah. Great. <laughs> it looks really good on the model. But why doesn't it look good on me? You never know. I might be able to turn this around. So now, I'm going to be using a different brush, try and like fill it out, I'm done, almost, I've just got to add the lipstick. So now I've just realised a massive issue, I didn't do... So, I didn't do enough pink, so now I would just gently dab it in. So, we 
you come over here and show you. Yeah, we're done. Bye, guys. Oh, wait, I forgot the lipstick. Oh, well, we don't need it. Bye, guys. I'll um, post the time lapse and the photos on my Instagram. I'll probably post, well, definitely going to post the time lapse video on my vlogs, on my vlog channel. Link in the description. Um, and I will, oh, I look dreadful. <laughs> And I'll be posting the photo on my Instagram so you'll be able to see it. Bye. Hi guys, I'm back. So I had like we had an issue with my camera. So don't worry, I'm gonna piece all this together. So we got the time lapse going yet again. So now I've got this brush. What's all that warning is in there now? And you done all that warning and you're sitting there. My mum's talking to my dog, not me by the way. No, she does whining non-stop anyway, don't you? Something else. Hmm. So I'm just going. I'm just trying to fill it in. <laughs> Say hi, mum. You, you ain't been in my videos in like three years. I do not know. <laughs> I should be embarrassed by that, but I'm so used. To, I'm numb to embarrassment. This makeup's gone terribly wrong already, and... <laughs> well, Molly, it doesn't surprise me. I know. So, if you want to see how it actually looks, I'll obviously I'll probably post it, I'll definitely post it on you the first somewhere. I want to be like James Charles. <laughs> Minus the scandals. Um, so, I'll, like I said, I've got the time lapse going. I'll post the time lapse on my vlog channel. It's like really hard, like... It makes it look so easy. Huh? Mum, I look like I'm in punches the face by a raccoon. So. I sent a picture to my friend, my friend Chloe, and she's like, oh, it looks really good. I'm like, hmm. So now all you want to do is you're going to blend it in. Because you don't want like the harsh line at the bottom of you. Then you go get some baby wipes. So I'm not, I'm really not happy with this. So then what you're going to do with these baby wipes is go dry, you're going to wipe half of it off. So then you just have this like triangle I really don't like it I I have generally very tried very hard but like if you see my some of my Instagram pictures go hashtag self plug I have done some good makeup but like you know so when it comes down to it like uh, do it on video it never works nice as a look I had to take a picture so now we're going to do the same thing as we did before but I'm going to be using Academy of Colour eyeshadow palette I'm also going to do another uh, makeup video today so I'm going to be using this brush and also this brush I'm just showing my time lapse. So we're using these three colours. So we're going for the lightest one. We're going for the lightest one first. With the smallest brush. Don't forget guys, if you can't really see it, don't worry because I have done a time lapse. For this. Which I will be posting on my... Um, vlog channel. So 
So you're gonna gonna go from the corner of your eye up to the top of the arrow. So the lightest colour. Then with this brush, you're gonna go for the middle colour. I'm just gonna fill that in the gap in between the triangle. the corner of your eye I don't do contour, I don't do uh, foundation, I don't do any of that so with this brush this the smallest one you're going to go back in with the Technique Technique Black Eyeliner and you're just going to kind of draw some of that back in you're going to kind of just blend it in so if you have two devices or you can borrow someone's phone then I would tend I would watch the time lapse I'm just going like up I'm gonna make in a cut eye like that it looks terrible but you guys could definitely probably do a better job than me so I'm very disappointed in myself so we know we're always done so now I'm going to do my eyebrows I tend to use the contour kit like I said from uh, where is it PS contour kit I got it from Primark I tend to go for the middle shade and just fill in my eyebrows. Sometimes I don't like the the middle shade so I tend to go in with the light one as well. I look disgusting. I swear to god someone like then I go in with the light one as well just to kind of make it not less orange a lot a little but when I usually wear makeup I always have my hair down so then you know now is the fun bit lashes got Lord have mercy so yeah like I said I'm also going to be doing another makeup look today I'm going to be doing a very difficult one I think well I think all makeup is difficult so these are lashes from Weight Makeup Accessories Nighttime False Lashes. I've got two pair. I think I got these from Poundland. I'm not really too big on lashes because I, I don't really wear them. So I literally just went downtown and I got a pair. So this is like five minutes of pain. So I'm going to stop the video in there. And you can see me struggle for like ten minutes on the time lapse. So I will start filming again once I've added the lipstick. So I'll see you in a minute.